Oh man, what a wonderful day of mining. I got so many supplies. It's just been a great day. I can't all wait to go home and just relax. Oh my god. What? No. No. My house. Everything. My chest. All my supplies are... Oh no. My animals. I was griefed. So guys, today it's me Kev5 bringing you another wonderful plugin tutorial. Today I'm going to be teaching you how Core Protect works. I, I hope you like the little intro um, right there. So today we're going to be teaching you how Core Protect works and all that good stuff. It's a very simple, easy to use plugin. Uh, you don't even really need to be in creative to use it either, so that's the cool part. So anyway, let's just switch to my cobblestone and hit the first command you're going to need to learn is Ko-I. Ko-I lets you inspect blocks that have been opened, broken, placed, everything. So Ko-I. Ko so watch this. If I open the door, it says the last person that opened my door, which was me. If I open the gate, it'll say the last person that opened the gate, which it says Con Guy 316 He griefed me? And usually I ban people, but I'm not going to ban him. He helped me out. Uh, so anyway, if you want to find out who placed a block, uh, you do that. It'll say who broke it. It says uh, I placed it, he broke it. If I punch a block, it'll say that Con Guy placed it. If I do this, it'll say who last opened it. And it'll say what they removed. So they removed all my wood and my seeds and everything. Uh, what was what was here? I believe there was a chest there. Anyway, um, that's all. We can all take care of that. What was that? I, th I think there's a wild con guy uh, sneaking around. Gosh, just come and fly around. Okay. So anyway, I'm going to be teaching you the command to roll this back. Uh, the command is very simple. This is for core protect, by the way. If I haven't already mentioned it, which I, I know I have, I'm going to kill you. Uh, anyway, so if you want to roll something back, everything starts with co, C-O. Next, you want to do player name. So we know con guy 316 is the one that griefed it. So what we want to know, um, how long ago was it? It says it was 0 .08 slash hours ago. Uh, we might as well just go one hour to be specific. So we do T, uh, one eight, one, one H, which is one hour. We can even go more specific with, uh, one minute even and one day, one week, one year, even if you, your server has been up that long and the grief was that long ago and you didn't notice it until now. What? Uh, nothing anyway. Uh, so next you want to do radius. So say the radius wants to be like, I don't know, you want to go like a radius of 50. You can do that. And this rolls back everything, and I will show you exactly what it rolls back. Like I said, items in my chest were taken out, my chest was broken, blocks were broken, doors were open, gate was open, my animals were killed. Uh, so anyway, let's roll this back. Con guy 316 not found? Oh yeah, you've, I forgot the rollback. You gotta do slash co rollback. Rollback. And, as you can see, everything, including the animals, were rolled back. So let's go take a look in the chest real quick. Uh, as you can see, the blocks that he placed were are gone. All the spot... Okay, my torch didn't, didn't come back. That's the weird thing, though. That is something... Um, I guess that's like a glitch. Uh, if you have a flower pot with a special flower in it, I guess it comes back as a rose. I didn't know that either. Uh, as you can... Oh yeah, let me get get out of Koi real quick. Uh, if I check my chest, all my belongings are back. Uh, I had nothing in my dispenser. Uh, so anyway, everything comes back. And it's pretty neat and awesome. So uh, guys, I hope you enjoyed this video. I hope this was educational for you. Uh, Core Protect, it really doesn't require anything. Uh, if you need to learn how to install the plugin, I have a video on that. I will leave in an annotation above. Uh, bucket plugins are not hard to install. Get out of here, Con. No one wants you. Uh, so, guys, I hope you enjoyed this video. And a lot of um, rollback plugins, by the way, I just had wanted to mention this, uh, require an SQL database. This one comes uh, fully equipped with one. You don't have to. Do anything, you install it, restart your server, and you're ready to go. 
uh, the commands you will have to give permissions to do rollbacks and stuff for your admins uh, very easy I'm gonna kill you you know what let's do it so guys I hope you enjoyed this video and as always have a nice day